Hello, my name is Dr. Dana Dawson. I'm a reader in cardiovascular medicine and a consultant cardiologist at the University of Aberdeen and Aberdeen Royal Infirmary. One of our main areas of interest here in Aberdeen is a condition called broken heart disease or stress-induced cardiomyopathy. A broken heart presents like a heart attack and can be fatal. Although it afflicts mostly, although not exclusively, women, the most interesting feature of this condition is that it develops in people who experience a very strong emotional or physical stress. We have recognized this condition only in the past 20 years or so, and with the help of the research that we have been doing here in Aberdeen, we have become better at diagnosing it. We know, for example, now that it's not as rare as we initially thought. We also know that it is very important to distinguish it from a heart attack, from a true heart attack, because not only the treatment is very different, but also the implications for what is there to come are also very different. Contrary to initial beliefs, we show that broken hearts don't actually heal, or at least don't heal as quickly as we initially thought. And in a significant proportion of patients, they evolve into a syndrome of heart failure, which means that the pumping function of the heart becomes affected in the long term. There is no current effective treatment for this mysterious condition, and research into this condition is fascinating, and it is an ever-evolving field. A broken heart is undoubtedly the strongest interaction between the mind and the body that has ever been described in medicine. And it is rather surprising that it has taken the medical profession centuries to recognize it as such. Thank you.